guys, it's Alice. So for today's video, I thought I'd show you what I carry in my everyday pencil case for college and um, what the pencil case is. And yeah, so I've got everything laid out in front of me, um, ready to show you. But first, I'm going to show you the pencil case I'm, I'm currently using. I got this in a set of three from Primark. It's actually a makeup bag, but I thought... I could use this as a pencil case and then I could put everything I need in one in one place. I mean, it's got A's all over it. My name begins with A. Anything with A's on, I am kind of addicted to buying things with A's on. I'm not going to lie. Um, so yeah, this is a pencil case I'm using. It's pink. It's um, I'm all for using makeup pouches as um, pencil cases because, yeah, you need my hair more. So I'm actually going to repack this as I show you the products, like as I show you everything. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to show you are the Papermate Ink Duo Ballpoint Pens. And these are the retractable ones. I much prefer the retractable ones. I don't know why. Um, they've got really cool patterns on. I've also got the capped ones as well, but I really like these ones. Um, so these four I use for my colour coding system um for each of my teachers so these three are for my different health and social care classes and this one is for my english class um and then i have the other six um for notes i also use these for notes too but this is predominantly the, what i write in my plan so any assignment deadlines any kind of things like that and then these ones i are exclusively fun ones more fun pens but yeah i use these i like i say i prefer i don't know why i prefer the retractable ones over the um kind of capped ones i think they're called just like the normal ones um but yeah i really rate paper make pens anyway so yeah i have these come in 10 different colors i think the capped ones only come in eight colors so yeah then I have some more miscellaneous pens. I have a Sharpie S gel gel pen. Sometimes I like to write in gel pen. Um, yeah, I just and the Sharpie one is this one. It's point seven. It's a point seven nib. Really good. If I don't have this one, I have the Papermate Ink Joy gel pen. Um, again, it's retractable. Um, so yeah. Then I have a four in one multi, like the multi pen from Bic, um, and it's a blue, black, red pen, and it's got a mechanical pencil in it. Um, if I just want to have everything in one and don't want to have to keep changing colour, I can use that. I'm just gonna straighten myself up a little bit, but yeah, I always carry one of these everywhere with me. Usually it has a green pen in it as well, but this one's got the pencil instead. Then I have one of my favourite, favourite, favourite fine liner pens. This is the Stabilo 0.88 fine, 0.4 nib in black. Um, sometimes I'll have a few different colours in my pen, in my pen case, but I always, 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 always carry a black one because, again, sometimes I like to write in fine liner. Um, yeah. Then I have this 0.38 fine line pen. This is a really fine nib. You can't even see it. Um, this is from the works, which is like a local book, like a little book, like, like a little store that sells books and stationery and things like that. Um, and I got this in there, and it was like I think it was like a pound or two for a pack of three. And they are so good. I'm actually going to go and buy some more. But yeah, again, really good. Then I have this one from the router. I got it in a set off of Amazon with a few other bets. Um, and yeah, it writes well. It was, yeah, I don't really have much to say about this because I don't use this one this often. But I like to have it just in case. Then I have a Papermate flare pen in black. I use this for headings. Um, it's a medium nib. Um, it doesn't bleed through paper. So I use it for my titles when I do my notes, like my neat notes. So, yeah. so then I'm going to move on to pencils. I have two wood pencils, again from the works. They've got grips on as well, which I really like. I don't know why I've got two, but they're both in here. Um, and the grip is removable, so sometimes I don't use the grip, sometimes I do. 
um, yeah. Then I have a Narita 0.5 millimeter lead pencil, um, mechanical pencil. I don't use this very often, but I do like using mechanical pencils, so it's always handy to have. Next, and the next pens I'm going to show you are highlighters. I have this set from Paper Chase again for colour coding and highlighting. These are my colour coding and yeah, this one this one is the one I predominantly use, but then I also have a purple one just in chaos. And then I have the Sharpie S Note highlighters. These are the ones I've got doubles of, but I will sometimes put other ones in my pencil case or I will use the Stabilo Swinkle pastel set um and fine liner set just just because really um so yeah I have these I really like these and um, I've got more colours and um, yeah again really pretty set and I always find I need to highlight stuff in my notes so yeah then the last bit I, I'm going to show you is my kind of miscellaneous kind of random bits. So the first thing I have is post-it notes. I can't, I wouldn't have survived, wouldn't survive this course without post-it notes. Um, I use them on my notes, in my planner, like um, in my planner, which I will do a planner tour um, at some point. So I write like extra bits of notes for the assignments I do, any feedback, um, stuff like that. I find these so useful. Um, so yeah. Then I have some scissors and a glue stick, just in case you never know. I have a sharpener. Um, don't know where I got this from. Just a random shop. And then I have a eraser from Narita. I have a little pot with some. Oops, dropping them all. Some paper clips, and um, in case my I do carry a mini stapler with me in my bag. But if it runs out, then I've got paper clips to clip any papers in until I get home to file them away. And if anyone else needs paper clips, then I have their backs. I have a USB stick just in case. I don't use it because I use my own laptop when it comes to college, um, which is what I'm filming on, coincidentally. Um, but yeah, I have that. And I always just give it in my pencil case so I know where it is. Then I have a ruler, again from Naruto. It's a 15 centimeter ruler. Um, again, just in case I hadn't used this. And then I have Tipex. This is like a little Tipex mouse. Really handy. And then I have some HB lead for my mechanical pencil. And that is everything that I carry with me on a day-to-day -day basis. So thank you all for watching. Um, I hope you have a good week. And yeah, I will see you all soon. Bye.